but it more than just the hot meal. I didn't think of this, but the volunteer that delivers my hot meal is for the most part the only human being I will see that day. And many times the driver will spend five or ten minutes just chatting to me and the, I will ask them about their family or their children, and about my situation. So it's that little social interaction. And not only that, but I get a, a sense of belonging to not just the Wheels on Meals, Meals on Wheels community, but also I get um, a, uh, a flower, fresh flower <laughs> every month. I'm just going to zoom in here or, or just highlight. I get a flower yeah. for my birthday, beautiful little rose and a vase and a handwritten birthday card um, on certain holidays that I might get a, like a little box that was colored by uh, school children that might have like a little COVID care package in there with <laughs> tissues or and uh, um, hand sanitizer or mask or whatever. Um, just random holiday or special occasion or just, um, you know, we're thinking about you. Little gifts like that that put a smile on my face and make you know help me feel like I'm not just living alone isolated in this house because of my um, my uh, medical uh, restrictions so I feel connected to the greater community more than the mail the meal delivery and it it made a big difference to me I didn't even realize that I missed that sense of connection until I re-experienced that sense of connection. And I'm like, oh, this that's right. I'm feeling connected again, and I haven't had that in, in years. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful.